On October 23rd, Congressman Seth Moulton, along with Mayor Nicholson and others, toured Leo's Early Education Center at 156 Broad Street. Leo's CEO, Brigadier Damon, spearheaded a tour, providing information about the construction and going over what will be in the completed space. We're going to take okay. you down to the lower level. That's where we have our commercial kitchen, conference room, and all okay. like that. We're going to go into the kitchen. We cook and prepare all our own meals. Really the um, most nutritious meal they get right. you know, through the day is with us. So this lower level, we will have three classrooms. Leo has received a $1.3 million allocation thanks to Congressman Moulton's support through Community Projects Fund, which has helped fund this expansion that has been worked on since last summer. One of our two playgrounds will be here, and okay. this is large enough to accommodate two classrooms at a time. Okay. So we're really excited about that. After the tour, Congressman Moulton sat down and heard from parents and staff about what Leo has done and can do with this newly updated building. Since day one at registration, they made me feel very comfortable and very supportive. They let me know that they're going to do everything they can possible to take care of my child. Your uh, work is important to not only to Leo's organization, but to entire community here. And not only this community, but Leo works for so many towns around. There's really no debate that education is the best investment, but there's also really no debate that the best education investment is early childhood, right? It's not where we spend most money. We should have the best universities in the world, but if we have the best universities in the world, we should also have the best early childhood education in the world, and we don't. We don't. And Harvard's 14 miles from here. When this facility opens early next year, they will feature 15 preschool classrooms for 230 three- to five-year-olds, two playgrounds, a kitchen, and more. Well, thank you again for coming, and oh, cool. we are very appreciative of the funding that you were able to secure for us. For LCTV News, I'm Riley. Visit lintv.org news for videos, press releases, interviews, and more, all for free.